welcome back to our survival let's play on no man's land um, it's something like episode 44 now I think um, nearly at the 50 mark it's flown over really you'll see I mean if you watched the end, the last episode we said we were going to get another episode in in this in game day however I didn't realize that for some of it I was still on um, point 0.5 time speed so I was sort of getting away with um, having the time slowed down which I didn't want to do so what I've done I've done a few things off camera um, you'll have seen a couple of them right at the beginning uh, on a really and it will have been a really quick time lapse as well probably not even a minute long uh, and then once we've done this, once we've finished putting canola in this field, we're going to um, go and rest and then go into the next day. I um, The things that we've been doing off camera, field number four there, the one on the hill, I've quickly put some fertiliser, because I didn't have much fertiliser at all left, I only had something like 500,000 litres, 500 I wish. Uh, 500 litres um, of fertiliser left so we've used the majority of that on that little field there we've got three four at least four fields now that need fertiliser on them including on the grass fields um, in fact it might not include on the grass fields no it's not the two canola um, and then the two barley as well both need fertiliser on them and um, this one that one to the right there and then number field number one haven't got any on yet but we just couldn't afford to buy any you'll see that we're up 6,000 um, what we've done is we've sold some wood and the wood we've sold is from so over on top of that hill, just to the right of centre, in the middle of our bi like biggest news field, um, we started chopping down some of that. The trees aren't particularly big, um, most of them were just the small ones that I could pick up in a wanna. Um, so we, we haven't got much money for them, just we needed to start clearing it anyway. And we need the money, we need to get up 20, 20 grand on me so we can get this um, sawmill so let's go and park this I love the amount of seed you don't use because with canola it's absolutely brilliant what's that there? is that seed? that's seed oh yeah because I went and brought some down I went and filled this and then brought it back down, didn't I? Is that going to fill that? Yeah, it is. Right, we'll get this parked. We'll get resting. And then... We'll see what we need to do next day. The main thing... Oh, I'll tell you one of the other things we've done. We've got a full stack of... Um, our bales that we've took over to the store ready to sell they're still over there now um, possibly still attached to the styre as well I can't remember right let's go and rest This is so much better as well, this feature, rather than what it was like in 19, where you had to wait and it would say you're not tired. Right, October. Do you know, I feel like I could rest myself. Um, so this is ready. What's this? Barley. Good. Does that mean this other side won't be ready though, will it?
No, that was one month behind that one. Um, let's have a look at these bills over here, see if they're ready. This grass needs cutting as well. Uh, that might be something we do today, actually. We need these bills ready. That's what we need, because we need the funds. If these bills are ready, that'll be job one for today. No, that's just over 50%. I ain't mean, got to take so long. Right, in that case, it's not quite light yet. I'll come back in an hour or so. Right, it's just gone eight. We've been up and collected the stye from the store, and we've also spent 1800, 1850 possibly, on a bag of fertilizer. Because, um, like I said, we're in desperate need. What I'm going to do with that barley field, I'm just going to wait until the full lot's done, which I th I'm sure it's next month. I'm sure it was only one month behind. Uh, because there's a strip right down the middle of it that hasn't been ploughed yet. So, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave it for now. And more importantly, we need to get some of this, some of our crops fertilised. Um, right, I'm going to need to put... I've just been looking at the price of eggs as well. We're going to sell... That's what I want to we're going to sell some eggs um, today. See if we can get up to that. Uh, 50, not 50. 20,000 mark. Obviously, the end goal, like I was talking about in the last one, the end goal is to be getting furniture. Um, to get furniture, we need planks. To, ne to get planks, we need the sawmill before we can get the carpentry building. So, I think all in all, to get the two buildings, it's 80 grand. Um, 20 for the sawmill, and then 60 for the carpentry I'd seem to struggle a little bit there yeah, it's covering it all we're probably overlapping a little bit to be honest but it's not too bad Right, we might as well go straight into this one. Oh, that needs weeding as well. I forgot about that. Which means the big one will need... ...need weeding. I mean, it's all well and good getting these big fields until <laughs> stuff like that needs doing, isn't it? With the equipment we have as well. That's great, the spreader, isn't it? Stuff like this are just, it's phenomenal. There we go, and we'll get this back on there.
at least this canola looks like it's going to be easier to do the weeding with because with the barley you just you can barely see it I mean I don't know if you can feel it watching it but just playing the map and the way we've got it at the minute we feel like we're literally on the cusp of hitting the big of being able to generate the amount of money we need to be able to do what we want but it's just getting over that cusp that's all it is Should be hitting most of it, if not all of it. Yeah, we're getting all of it. I don't know if we'll have enough actually for the for the other field as well. It's this here, all of that needs fertilising. The only reason I knew is because I saw the shadow. Like I said, it's very rare that I play with the sound actually on. I haven't got it on now. So, I had no idea whatsoever. If I hadn't been for the shadow, I wouldn't have known. Oh, this one won't need weeding, will it? Not this time round, because it's brand new. That is an absolute bonus to be honest I'd have done it off camera anyway I might have started it on camera but there's no way I'd have made you sit through that I need to get rid of that stump as well one of the things I did do in the yesterday's in-game day um, it was just before I started recording today's episode actually I started clearing the way so that piece of land that we own um, up near the store this one here there, this one um, obviously this is where the the different production chains are going to go when we get them um, so I started clearing the smaller trees from that area so we could start putting the factories in when we get a chance so I got a load of trees all these little ones here just like what's on the left hand side all the ones where you can just pick up and throw them on and I must have cleared about I don't know between somewhere between 8 and 12 I'll have cleared put them all on top of the cell point thinking it would get us at least sort of I don't know 2 grand it got us £300 and I don't know why because if I I've took I can't even see where I'm at here I've took um, less than that over from here and got more cash so I don't know why We only got that much money. I didn't strip them. Could that be a reason? Possibly. I 
vyšájame. Je, yeah, no by much like. It's a shame. Because I don't really want to spend another 1800 quid yet. Um, I'll get this turned off now. Right. Let's go over to the eggs. Right, we haven't been spending our time just chasing the deer. That's going to run straight. No, it didn't. I avoided it. Um, we've been loading up the tipper with eggs. Now, I think in the, the last patch that they did, which will have been a couple of weeks ago now, wasn't it? I think one of the updates was around pallets. If it wasn't, I might be wrong. Um, and about fixing them. My first three pallets that I picked up were fine. The second, maybe three, this might be the fourth, have been gone mental. Um, one in particular. I mean, this one, does it stop jigging about now? Yeah, it does. But I mean, one of them literally just flew flew off the um, front loader up into the air and over there somewhere the stack like this I wouldn't really want to put our eggs like this however I've got no other way of transporting them um, and I did say I had them all nice down there well those ones that are on the side um, were the ones that were misbehaving and basically was sticking and jumping around and just not doing as they were told I think that's all them it is right how much are we going to get for these um, so we're getting 12.39 What did we sell them for last time? I could be, do you know, I could be driving up there while I'm looking at this, couldn't I? I'll do that instead. Off the top of my head, I think we sold them at around 12.60. Last time. Right, now we can look. Yeah, 12.60. We sold them for last time. So I mean, I don't mind selling them at. We only was it twelve thirty nine? We said. So we're not far off. Right, let's get up there. Right, just about here. I don't know what we've got in total because. Um, let's have a look. The tipper doesn't tell us. So 14, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Um, probably around maybe 9,000 litres, something like that. There they go. I mean, this is very much what we need to do. Not be selling our crops. Um, are you going to start going or not? not selling our crops just as is we need to be getting these productions going growing the crops for the chickens growing the um, crops for I don't know flour mill something like that right I think we made some decent money there 
11,300 we're just under 14,000 um, we're not far away at all are we I mean at the minute we've got nothing else to sell we've got them soybeans but I mean the price is ridiculously low isn't it October yeah it's like rock bottom uh, so we've got over half a year until we can sell that um, trees we've got trees to sell but I don't particularly want to be doing that straight away um, tell you what I'll do while we're here I'll quickly buy another load of fertiliser now that we've made some money and at least we can get finished Do you know the fertilizer that I got um beginning of the this episode when we were off oh I'm trying to pick the wrong one up first start. That would be the lime. I was gonna say the fertilizer that I got right at the beginning of the episode, I just drove up to it and picked it up immediately. There was no hassle with it, just like that. Right, we'll get hooked back up to this and then down we go. Right, let's go back. We're down. We will fill this up and then we'll do our customary refill the diesel. Does this take 4,000 litres? No way. Right, there's another £180 on diesel. Not too dissimilar from real life really, is it? So, for the rest of the day we need to weed that field over there and I want to cut this grass I might do the grass cutting as a time lapse actually might not be the worst idea ever um, I don't know how long I've been recording but I'll be honest I'm, I am quite conscious that I've been doing more off camera and I'm doing that because uh, let's see if we can get that I'm doing that so we don't um, we don't get bogged down basically I am having a mare get off right let's see if we can Start again. That'll do. That will do, donkey. I'll do. Right, get that off. I mean, I think, does that grass look as if it's in that double growth? I still haven't, and I really apologise to Felden, because he sent us this link about grass work absolutely weeks ago, and I still haven't watched it. But, in my defence, I've been mega busy to the point where I 
stopped being able to put videos out every night because of just I know I've explained this a few times, but just how busy I am in in real life. Um both at home and at work. It's and I won't be watching it tonight. I know I won't, because in fact even in the next two days because I've got so much on the next couple of days that I just won't be able to. What do I want? I want the more donor. Yeah, so does that look like it's grown? Any or not? Do we get double growth stages? I feel like at some point someone's just gonna watch it and just tell us what happens in it. But I will watch it. Right, let's get this out. We'll go around the edge. I still as well. I mean, I feel like we're um, we sort of we've made a plan for what we're going to do with regards to the factories. I still haven't uh, thought about what I'm going to do with this bit of land here. I'm thinking, and I think there's a lot of thinking. I think if I didn't mention it in the last video I was certainly thinking <laughs> funnily enough about it of completely just um, replanting it with trees doing it now and then like really getting our production going that might be a decent idea Spend maybe three or four grand on saplings. Then we've got that guaranteed source of income, and we especially if we can get the factories we want. Right, as I contemplate that. Because although I don't know how long we've been recording for, I know it'll be getting on. Don't, 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 don't. I know we'll be getting on. So I'm going to put a time lapse on here. It will definitely jump into the different jobs that we need to do, or else the time lapse will be about six minutes long, six or seven minutes long if we don't. So we'll do that. I'll be back towards the end, and then I don't know. We might weed that. Um, field. In fact, in this in-game day, we will definitely be weeding that field. So I will be back. Very well. Just about done, and it has took. I'll put it back on times five. Um, I put it on times one when we started doing this because 
time was rapidly moving on. Um, it took a long time to do that. We've got 44 bales out of it, which is great. Like, really, really good. It was fully fertilised. It hasn't got any lime on it. Um, and it needs rolling as well. You can see the stones are in it. So, I mean... I don't know whether we'll be able to pick them stones up now or not. The other thing I don't know is whether if we use a roller the roller we've got will that count? those stones might be too big to roll back in um, we'll have to have a look a couple of things from here I am so glad just doing that there getting them 44 bales of this so I'll show you on the map so this is the area here, what we've just done. I am so glad that we put canola in that field um, up on, well, all this here. Because we did discuss about turning that into a grass field as well and just just going all in on bales, on um, silage. The equipment we've got now just isn't big enough to do that. There's no way that I could have remained sane and carry on doing that. Bearing in mind, grass work is probably my favourite thing that we do. Um, the equipment's just too small for um, for that sort of work on that scale. So that was one thing. that I noticed. The second thing was um, have you seen how much fuel we've used? We've used half a tank of fuel just doing that. So we filled it up just before we started didn't we? I'm just going to grab this see if we can use it. We're nearly at the end I'm going to finish the episode soon but um, just while we're on camera I'll, I'll see if we can if this will work. Um, yeah, half a tank of fuel doing that one field. Obviously we've got everything up to the max as hard as you can get it so it kind of shouldn't be surprising but oh my god we use so much. Right, so that nope there on are we picking up? No, nah, I didn't think it would be, to be honest. I had more hope for the um, for the roller, but I'm not sure if the roller we've got will work on grass fields or not. That's what I was uh, sort of concerned about. Get that foot back, and I might use well use the sixty one or five to uh, to do the rolling with. How are we looking for fuel there? No. We're alright. We've got enough. The, that weeding in field number two, I'm going to do off camera. I've already decided because although although we've just time lapsed that massive bit of grass work there, um, I still think the episode's quite long. Right, is that doing anything? No. So you must have to get... You must have to get a specific grass roller. Um, grass care.
I mean, that's not that expensive, is it? I wonder if it was part of the pack that I'm using now. They weeders. Oh no, they're big rollers. Do you know, they're not that bad either. 7.2 metres for 17 grand. I mean, that looks alright, doesn't it? Why that's any different to the one we've got now, I do not know. But the game recognises it as, as, as such. Um, one of the other things, when I've said about the equipment being too small, one of the other things that we are definitely going to need is a new, um, a new way to collect the bales. And that new way is going to be some sort of auto loader. Whether that be one of the mechanical ones, or whether that be one of the um, the trailers where you drive past and it picks them up. I have a feeling it's going to be the latter, purely because the former is 50 grand when I can get one of the trailers for about 17. Might as well leave that there. Yeah, I can get one of the trailers for about 17. So I can't justify not using one of them really. I'll tell you what we need to have a look at as well. I'll drive over now before I get started with this. Um we need to have a look to see these other bales over here how far along they are I mean I know I've been talking about there about rollers and picking up stones and stuff like that to get 44 bales off that area I was really pleased with I mean they're not the biggest bales they're only three and a half thousand litres um, but still a lot it's still a lot of silage Seventy percent. So, in the next episode of this, they'll be ready. Because all I'm going to do with this now is I'm going to weed, and then there's nothing more to do in this in-game day. Everything else has been done. I mean, I could chop down some trees but I don't particularly want to to be honest I want to wait until we've um, we've got the sawmill which we easily going to be able to afford once we get rid of that silage see got it all worked out right we need weeds on that off I mean, to be honest, I can see on this one, it's great. I can see where the weeds are and where we need to pick up. So I kind of feel like we've got a lot done without doing much today. Um, the thing that I wanted to do, I wanted to get the sawmill built today. That's what I wanted. We just, with how long that silage is taking to ferment, without going around cutting a load of trees down, that wasn't going to happen. I mean, I was really pleased with the amount of money we got from the eggs. Um, I think we got about twelve grand, and we just under twelve grand for the eggs. So, I was pleased in that regard. The soybeans that we grew is now wildly out of season. The, for the second load and the first load we managed to we made a lot of money on but the second load obviously we planted too late for um, which is my fault I mean I thought we might have just sort of snuck in there but it wasn't to be I certainly didn't think the price would go down as heavy as what it did so I mean those we've got 7,900 litres I think 
um, they're just going to have to wait till next year now. We'll not see any return whatsoever for a while. Uh, the canola, obviously we've got two fields worth of canola now. I haven't actually looked. I can't remember how long it takes for canola to grow. I think it's eight months, but off the top of my head I can't remember. So I'll have to have a look at that and then see if we're sort of in date for that. I mean, the money will come, it'll just come later, that's all. In the short term, the money is going to be from the eggs and the silage, isn't it? And if we can get up to that number where we can get the carpentry uh, production going, the furniture, then I think that'll be us quids in. But this is where I'm going to leave it. I'm going to carry on doing this offline because... I mean, this is it. This is what I'm going to be doing. And I think the video is already going to be quite long, to be honest. So, the next one... Am I missing bits here? I need to go. Right, the next one, we should be able to, to get the factory up and running. And then, if we can't, I'll be very disappointed, to be honest. So, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you again in the next one.